All right, we're going to show a good way to cut your watermelon up today. Okay, first thing what we want to do is sharpen our knives. Okay, make sure we get the best out of our knives. All right, we'll have to use two different knives. Have them available. Off. You didn't shave me if I may have all over there. Okay. All right. Now we're going to get, you know, after you exercise, it's a good thing to rehydrate. And one good way to do that is eating watermelon after you've had your regular water and that sort of thing. But, uh, first thing you want to do is clean the watermelon off. Make sure you get it clean. If you get dirty in the store or what have you, wherever you might get it from, make sure you wash it off, get it and clean it off real good first. Sharpen your knives. Now we're going to do is cut the ends off. Okay. There's one. Let's cut the other side. And this is a big watermelon here. We're going to eat good for days on that bad boy. All right. We're going to take it and stand it up. All right. We're going to start cutting off the sides of the rind. We'll turn it as we cut it. Stripping this bad boy down. All this prep work. And the so when we cut, we can probably get a little bit of the meat out of here. And we've already have our containers assembled, so we just drop it right in there. Okay. There you go. And this one here, we just cut in a little bit. And we'll be able to scoop out some of the meat of the watermelon there. In a few times. Take it here, drop it right in. Good to go. And then this one. Okay. Alright. Who don't love them some watermelon, right? I'll tell you what. It's really good for you. It's citrulline in it and all kind of good nutrients beyond just the dehydration component of it. Laura's what melon too. You're gonna to enjoy this one. Yeah, a little bit of a spot we have to cut out on this one. Okay. Good to go. Strip the rind off all the sides. All we do now is start making some horizontal cuts across here. We come back with some vertical cuts like so in each direction. And we just take it and slide it off into our little containers. And we are off and running. Not literally running, but you know, metaphorically. And this one here is just falling apart. It can't wait to get into that bowl. It's like, get me in that bowl. Eat me up. I am good for you. Okay. Look at that. It's just falling in that bowl quicker than we can cut it. Look at that. All right. I'm filling these bowls up. Yeah. Take these bowls. I'm all stuffed to fill. They're doing good. Alright. This one here. There we 
go. Look at that. Mm mm mm. There's some good eating there now. Look at that. Woo! At lunchtime, you're gonna be glad you took the time to do this. You know what I mean? Just an efficient way to get your watermelon all prepared for yourself. Another one. It's one more yummy lunch day. Here's a little smaller bowl. Put it in. Okay. Look at that. Bam, bam. One bowl done. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. Being like thirds here. Look at that. Flipping around. And while you're eating, while you're preparing, you want to eat some too. Hmm. Hmm. That's flappy granny good. Hmm. Oh. Mm -mm -mm. See how easy that goes? Just a little bit of preparation on the front end. Preparing for the cuts. And then it just falls all together. Of course you want to make sure you don't have your hand in the way. Because you're cutting there. You don't want to have a finger in your bowl. Eh? Right. This warm out has come out a little bit unique in that it already cut up in three parts by Mother Nature. Interesting configuration there. Hmm. Alright, there's another bowl. And we're just moving right along here. Slide it on in there. Bam. There you go. You, know, you want to spend less time cutting and more time enjoying, right? Okay. And we're going to have some good lunches this week. Pumping our bodies full of some good vitamins. watermelon though. <laughs> yeah buddy. There's another bowl. These bowls are stacking up here. I'll get another one. Okay. Coming too now. Look at that. Mm -mm -mm. My, my. We're going to be eating good for days. You hear me? <laughs> All right, we're getting down to the bottom of it now. So, we're, what we're going to do is cut it in such a way that we can get the rest of the little bit of rind that was there off, trim it off, and we're just going to slice it up. Make a few cuts, transfer that over into our bowl. We have one there we need to cut again. Okay. Alright. Okay. Alright, and we're just 
of smoking through this thing. My goodness. part of it. Turn it over. Move the rind part. Okay. One melon just falling together here. Oh my. Okay. Pick up any ones we got left there. have it with a slight little clean up here and we are good to go that's 11 minutes watermelon cut lunch is made and you're good to go all right enjoy <laughs>